What's up, guys? So, this is satisfactory. Um, I don't know how I'm going to edit this. But yeah, we just decided we're going to work on um, trying to make our first factory here. Um, Nate's been running our electric for us. Um, actually, it looks like they've already kind of started here. We're just making the iron pipe and iron sheets, which are the two first basic factories that you'll start out with. Um, so we'll be working on that. Yeah, so we'll just kind of hop into that. I'm going to unmute and undeafen from Discord here in a second. Just adjusting my mic levels. Okay. All right, let's do this. Thank you. Thank you. You got it. Good luck. All right, I'm All ready. Right. Smelter. Tim, question. Yeah. Do you want the smelter? Um, before or after the storage here? Uh, the, well, the I'm smelter... The smelter, the, constructor. the smelter goes first. I'm at the constructor. Um, okay, so what are we working on? Is this we're going to go for the pipe? Everything. Well, let's do one at a time. Let's do the pipe and then the sheets. Oh, you mean rods? Yeah, rods. yeah, yeah, rods. You got... Okay, so, Nate, do you have copper wire? You'll want it to go... I don't remember what the ratios are. Can we have it go into one smelter and then split to our rod factory and our sheet factory? Or do we need two smelters? We yes, we splitters. Yeah. So we can prepare for it-ish. Not really. We don't have a single point split. <laughs> Interesting. We have to, what we need to do we is have make no way of splitting at all yet? Not Correct. until we get logistics. Not yet. We, okay. But right I'm going now, for base building right now. Right now, okay. we need to build crappy things, and then in the future, when we're evolved, we can do all that. All right, this needs power. Did you just delete my thing? Something. I mean, yeah, it fine. wasn't just lined up. up. Just, just make it where I'll you. I'll fix it. It wasn't lined up. Okay, I built. It has power. Everything is ready for temp. Uh, we need iron ingots. Why right. is this, uh, so this so close? This needs to go into the smelter and then into a constructor for um, to make rocks, right? That's what right? I asked you about. Do you okay. want the constructor before or after the storage? That's my question. Bring. How about you bring the smelter and we'll put it right over here, right next to the miner. And then make sure that orange is in the, the in and outs in the right spots. In the outs are in the right spots. You just want me to do it? Where? That look oh, good? Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, I think that's good. It looked completely different on my screen, but let's hope you got that. All right. So now, before we make this next one, we You're need to... We're going to make a special thing. Well, we need what? A constructor? Yes. Right? So, do you have the stuff to make a constructor on you? Hmm. You know what? Let's change this. Let's do like, let's see how this is going to look. Try not to. We're going to have to redo everything me. we're doing. Yeah, no. but there's no sense in getting bad, forming bad habits now. All right. So then make it beside it and then make the out. Line it up with that container, that first container on the left, the storage container, and make sure the out's facing the right way. Let's see how this, see if we can do this. What's this here for? You're not lined up with the storage container. I love lacks of concrete because this is porous. You're not What's lined not up. lined up with It's oh, not supposed wait, to be. I have no, to turn no, it. I see, I, see pull 180 here. I see what you're doing. Okay, you want to try to make it look? Pop a conveyor belt in here. Hmm, it won't stack. Oh, there it goes. I remember that. Yep. Ah, uh, the poles. Conveyor poles. I remember having to preset mm -hmm. conveyor poles. Oh, yeah. What's the. No, shift. Alt. Okay. Alt. Oh, my goodness. We have 10 hotbars, guys. Yeah. Well, alt do what? Alt scroll. And it goes through your 10 hot bars. Well, or you can just hit the number. No, uh, off, off. 
Oh, do our, do our conveyor pulls not... Can we not raise and lower them? We should be able to. I told you how to do it. Well, oh, you have to well, set, do it. You have to, to do it. No, man. you have to you have to set the rotation. Then you have to set the height. Remember rotation and then height. Yeah, Because when I hit click, it's done. So no, well, you hit it once and then go up and down. No, just okay, are you guys doing this? Like as you're saying it, click, click it once and then go there we up go. And down. I got it. What's I don't know how secret? I did it. <laughs> or while it's rotating, you just look up and down. Okay. Oh. Trying to get I it so that we can I walk did. under I it. Stopped, so I stopped using those except when I needed like half a space because there's a there's a there, ladder. Now I can walk under them. There's I conveyor frames that you get later on that are also ladders. That's right. Yeah, yeah, the frames. Can you walk under this? Good. Shut oh, up. we have to bring electric to this real quick. Okay, so iron rods take Oops. they take 15 iron ingots per minute and they produce one iron rod or they produce 15 per minute so they're one to one ratio we need power running this. uses four uh, megawatts I'm trying to get power right now I think we produce 15 how I'm much is our uh, miner doing how much did these uh, do? Everybody ready for the next uh, unneeded tutorial? These produce yeah. 30, so we could we could have two um, constru pipe constructors going on at once with one of these smelters. But we don't have splitters. Well, uh, this produces 120 per minute. We really need splitters. Milestone reached. You have unlocked several structures that's aimed to provide the first right, needed so basic factory infrastructure. We got ourselves a smelter here. The Building smelter's feeding into the constructor. And as and you saw, I've got the constructor producing iron rods. It'll spit that out. And then it'll go into this storage container. And this will hold our iron rods. And this will work while we are doing other stuff and it'll just keep piling up these uh, iron rods for us. Uh, this is our first little mini factory. This is a little tiny one. Some of the stuff gets so complex that like this whole area would just be one factory just producing one item. Uh, it's pretty cool, pretty cool game. All right, sorry, I'm back. No, no, so we just unlocked foundation. Oh, nice. I'm riding the conveyor belt. I'm working on splitters right now, y'all. Uh, you're on the conveyor belt. Yes, you're lagging. Are you lagging? Or are you on the conveyor belt? I was on the conveyor belt. belt. Yeah. Does it push you slowly? All right, Matt. So the okay. next thing is sheets. Yep. So we got. So go as soon as he gets splitters. Well, hold on. Let's 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 get splitters. Are the rods working right the now? Yes, are we are. We are rods. building up rods right now. Cool. If y'all can get fifteen per minute rods. Oh, there we go. Iron plates, it will do. Milestone exchange concluded. Fix it, freighter. It will make complete. two iron plates every 20 minutes. So, two to 20, that's a one to two every 20. That's essentially one every 10 minutes. So, we'll have a 1.5 to one ratio. Is it morning or nighttime? Must be morning. I think it's morning. Think it's morning. All right. Yeah, I think we should uh, not make anything else until we get splitters for our conveyor belts. So, what do we need for that, Nate? As you said, that's what you're working on, right? Uh, sheets and rods. It's the set as the current milestone. I'm okay. doing the wire right now. Okay. I will work and on rods. Cool stuff. I have fifty. I Dude, the amount of smoke that comes off of these, uh, the crafting bench down below when you do it for like an 20 minutes at a time, it starts smoking. <laughs> really? It does? Never noticed that. Yeah. Well, I think I held it down for like a full minute and the grills on the crafting bench start smoking. Oh, I see a oh, grill see down there. right now. No, oh, no, in the GUI that comes up, the grill to the either side of the craft button starts smoking. Oh, it I got gotcha. you. Yeah, like, I, I saw that. that. It made me like... stop crafting. Really? No, it's because I accidentally right-clicked. 
Well, maybe who knows. Are you guys both okay. making copper wire? I've got copper wire. No, now. I'm making plates. Copper wire is done. Okay, Matt's yep. making plates. All right, I'll get the rods then. Everybody Plus whatever we've rods made. If you want to switch it over real quick. Well, we'll be done with plates in no time. Yeah, yet. this isn't like a really fast. It's way, it's like a 50 times faster to just do it by hand right now. Especially with three of us. Right. I just, uh, next we'll make our plate factory, but, um, I think it's better to make two plate factories for the ratio to work out or something like that. So we don't die of boredom. Cause our smelter will do 15 per minute. Too much math in this game. But our plates will do two every 20 minutes. Trust or wait, math 20 every out. two minutes. So 10 every one minute. So it's a 1.5 to one ratio. So if we did two, it'd be a one to three ratio. You last time you figured this all out without when I didn't know what was going on. So I'm just, I know to, it's cause it's math. Where are you? Pretty much it's least common denominators is all this game is. You try to make the factories operate on least common denominators. I've got half the plates done. All right, where you at, Matt? Come to the constructor. If you want to learn or understand what I'm talking about, I'll try to show you. Uh, sure. Let me put these plates in. We need rods and we're done, which is okay. easy. Uh, I got rods. All right, hey, Tim. All right, so come How up to the constructor. You You're getting shocked. Uh, if you open the constructor, you can see that you know that you've seen that you can produce rods and plates, Milestone right? You know how to switch reached. it. Conveyor belts yes. are now merged. Okay, so you read how what it what it produces. How fast? You can we yep. encourage you to consider more verticality there. when it comes okay, you're to distracted. logistics to streamline short range uh, transportation. What am I doing? Re re recipe? How many plates display, will this constructor and produce the and how quick? Three. With optimization. One, what? One to one. It will produce through plates? Yes. This, it will do three plates in six seconds. No, what? I don't know what you're even talking about. Okay, you click on iron plates. Yeah. It says right here, plain as day, two iron plates per 20 minutes. Or two iron plates. It produces 20 per minute. And it uses three iron ingots. Okay, so it uses three iron ingots. It produces two iron plates. Yes. That's why it's better to do have two of them because it'll be an even fraction. Uh, if we have, or was it two two smelters and three constructors? Because the smelters produce thirty iron ingots per minute. Okay, so yeah, we'll basically okay. Pretend we're, we want to do iron sheets, okay? The smelter is giving us 30 iron sheets every minute. We can only produce 20, or the smelter is giving us 30 iron ingots per minute. The constructor can only construct 20 sheets per minute. So we're going to be backed up on iron ingots and not be efficient. Does that make sense? We're going to be producing uh, 10 more uh, iron ingots than we need per minute. Where's this per minute coming from? It only tells you me just click in it seconds. and look at where it's produced. Minute. Okay. See that? 30, 30 per minute. 30 per minute. Okay. And this does 20, 20 per minute. Yeah, you so see how that? So that's a two third. That's a. You're trying to shove 30 ingots into something that can only do 20. 20. So that's going to back up and our conveyor belt. Is, is two thirds. So. Two smelters and three constructors. Yes. That's the most efficient way to make sheets. That means that the, everything will be running two smelters and three as fast as possible. But early on like this, that stuff's not quite as important. That's more like when you're making a factory that needs a certain amount of iron sheets. What's that noise? What is above know. us? This HQ has something going on. 
I think Nate's doing something. I think he sent something. What'd you say about me? I don't know. Did the just, hub was doing something, do and you're standing there, so I didn't know. Uh, that was the cooldown on no. research nails. resetting. Oh, okay. Because there's you a nails. cooldown timer on it now because game mechanics and gating speed runs not being real. Okay. Um, do we have splitters? Uh, we have no. splitters. I'm no. working on, yes, we have splitters. And lifts, good. All right, Matthew, do you want to work on making the sheet, the sheet, sheets with me since we have splitters now? I can That or should I take resources and go get copper and bring it over here or or the other nah. one that's not proper, limestone? Nah. We need enough resources to construct two smelters and three constructors. Right now. Should have everything we need. You have to make the reinforced iron plates by hand. So we have plenty. Okay, so you need, say it one more time, two constructors. Three constructors two and two smelters. Cool. Can you attach, couldn't you, isn't there a way to attach the splitters directly to the miner? Um, maybe. Yeah, like target the thing itself and you can kind of get an output. I always oh, I need cable. Shoot, do we have a uh, cable laying around? I need two. Maybe. Make, I've got a uh, six cable. Okay. Here's six. Thank you. Did I get that? Okay. Where are we getting our power from? Uh, uh, biomass generators off the back of HQ. Did we make some or did those come with the HQ? That comes that, with the they HQ. They come with it and then we okay. get to make some later. So we're probably going to want to set up a power hall here in a bit. I think gotcha. our grid caps out at about 30. We did leave you with that factory for a long time until we replaced it with a giant coal factory that I made way too compact and only got working by the skin of my teeth. It was a nightmare. I loved that factory though. I'll make it bigger the next time. I promise. I guess more compact. Whatever makes you happy. Yeah, I did like it. Okay, I have just enough freaking things. All right, we're, how do I make cable? Okay, I got enough for that. And then some cable. Alright, and now I need rods. Alright, Tim, I got everything you requested. Okay. Yeah, we'll need some concrete. I have 60 on me, if that'll do for now. And 140 more Probably, stone. you need one for a conveyor pole, I believe. So, anytime you need to lift it, lift the belt or something, use them. This will go. Oh, if you run and hold down crouch, you slide. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Crouch is C for some reason. Probably because control. I made it. We need three constructors. Not. It looks so bad. Well, I, I agree, but also it's just kind of this cascading flow of uh, everythingness. Okay, so these need to splitter. Those will need a merger. I got concrete. <clears throat> Good. And then a conveyor lift. Oh, gross. Oh, I forgot you could do that. And then this. To, um 
What is this called? There. That will go there. Let me mute them so I'm not talking um, over them. Um, we'll have our two smelters I'm going to put here feed into this merger here. So this merges two conveyor belts together into one. This is an elevator, so it'll feed the items down into this splitter, which allows you to split one conveyor belt into three, which will allow us to feed these three constructors uh, iron ingots. And then we can construct iron plates with those and it produces 20 per minute. Each one of these constructors produce 20 per minute. So 20 times three is 60. So we'd be producing 60 per minute. So I just need to make sure all of this stuff can handle 60 per minute. I believe a conveyor belt does 60 per minute. Oops. Uh, yeah, 60 per minute, which you can upgrade all this stuff and we will, but for now we can do 60 per minute. So we'll be okay. Um, these, these splitters and mergers, I believe can do 60 per minute as well. Oh, actually it doesn't say. So I think that means there can do unlimited. There's no limit. Um, okay. And then our two smelters, which this is a smelter right here. Uh, as I was showing Matt, oh no, this is a, this is a smelter. Sorry. The smelter is what turns the ore into ingots, obviously. And it produces 30 per minute. So like I said, we're, we're we need 60 per minute. So I'm gonna have two smelters. So that's what I'm doing here. All right, I'm back. How much cable? Um, where do you want Hold the power? Here. Uh, I need it for my two smelters and my three constructors. Yes, where do you want it to be? I'm building a automatic thing. Where do I want it to be? Where? What's an automatic thing? What do you mean? Uh, I am going to build setting a power up the plant. biomass uh, generator oh. stuff. Because I don't know. We've already committed the number while. one sin of what? being. I listen to you. Well, I know. It's just I don't know if there's any way to avoid it at this early stage. None of space. Oh, um, why are these black? The Wait, analysis machine. did I change their colors somehow? I swear oh, these look the black. Uh, maybe maybe it is a lighting glitch. Okay. Hey, Matt, did you grab that concrete or should I go get it from Nate? Yep, I got it. I have to go. Uh, I have to build it Nate do you have concrete I have 68 get the HUD I just need a, just whatever you can spare Hello. thank you Gladly. I have more Tim I'm building it right now All right, I don't need any more right now but surely we will that's actually the next thing we'll probably make is a concrete factory okay there we go so we'll make this maybe go here and then turn I feel like an ant. Why? I'm building so much concrete. Oh. Okay. Nate, every single time I craft, I get like one more particle of that little explosion that happens yep. when you're done crafting. Yep. See how many Alrighty. Once I get power, we'll be able to produce our 60 steel plates per minute. Yes. And my question is, where do you want the power plant? Um, I guess, I mean, I, like I said, it doesn't matter right now. I mean, so build it by behind the HUD, maybe where the other ones are. Okay. Why can't you connect a merger or a splitter right to anything? That's kind of dumb. I thought you could. Tim. What are, wait, what are we doing? We're trying we're to, just trying to what set what a base do. factory, like a base foundation. Hmm. Why is it so high? I don't because know. Because the ground's uneven and I figured you might as well start high and not miss everything. Okay. Yeah. Do we have stairs? We have ramps. Yeah, we have ramps. Same oh, idea. Okay. But what would have been ideal is if, we, if they would have given us floors to start with, we could have just made this entire place a level service. I know. Let's do that now. Let's go do concrete. We could do that now and, then, and make move our base. Yeah, let's go move our base. I like. But yeah, idea. we'll need concrete. If we had a level surface, it'd be a lot easier to make everything organized. 
I agree. and less spaghetti. Well, we need to probably figure out, come up with a plan in our heads of where we're going to build all this and like, uh, before we do any of that. I was thinking like the other side of the lake. Right okay. here. Build across the lake and over to there. Well, the lake is going to be our source of power eventually, right? Okay. So we need to be somewhat close to that. So I was just thinking the other side looks really flat. Oh, um, uh, yeah. Well, it's kind of some trees, but we'll get it. Yeah, yeah, I just, I guess for me, it's like, I just want to have like a plan and not yeah. work without a plan because then like I just created that back there and I'm really unhappy with it. It's like spaghetti. It's clustered. It was, it everything's was different neat. levels. That it's not even working. We don't, e don't even have power for it. So it's just useless right now. So uh, if we yeah. had a plan, it'd be like, okay, well, let's do the power first because we can't even use the factory. So we have the power. So we have power set up. Then you build the f factory, you know, but then you need all these resources to build the power. So it's like, okay, well, we need resources. So we start building the resources. Yeah. So we box this I in know. into a sarcophagus and uh, yeah. pretend it never existed. What Run. we do is we build some crappy thing here. No, we can leave and it here. We move, we move yeah. away. Far that's what away I'm. From that's it. what I'm saying right now. I'm saying this can stay like this, and we'll go spend time making stuff look organized and less chaotic on the other side of the lake. Don't forget about this. Right. They're not forget well, about it, but. Well, let's all drop what we're doing. Let's run across the lake and go look together and come up with a game plan. I'm building a bunch of concrete, so we're prepared. Sound good? Well, let we should no, go oh, no. figure out what we're gonna do, and then roll. once we have a plan, we'll then we'll put it into action. All right, where are we heading? Because maybe we'll get over there, and there'll be a reason why we can't go over there. Yeah, over there. I'm just swimming. I don't think you can swim down. You can just you can jump into the water to go down. That's the only way I figured out how to do it. Unless I mean, it's kind of weird they haven't added that yet. Yeah, don't die from fall damage in the water. Spam space if you ever fall into the water. I've lost. Exactly. When this you is drop a nice little items. area to start. Look, it's flat mm -hmm. enough. Oh, there's a big... These hills here are kind of annoying. What are these? Cactus? Cacti? Oh, uh, you see that forest? Else. No, that don't want to do it. Hey! I, oh, my goodness. Oh, there's a crash here. Yeah, we need the ma'am thingy. Are we going to fight him? Are we fighting him? There's a thing? Uh, there's a research tool to scan stuff. Are, we gonna Are you guys punching something? I was. I'm just. Whoa! Saying. Oh! 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 Bees! Ah! There's bees. Uh, I killed them. Me too. I died. Oh, they don't do much damage. Don't worry about it. And there's suicide bombers too. Are you guys able to fight them without lagging? Yeah. yeah. It's better than what it was. 192 Oh, no. I killed a lizard doggo. Now he's all blurry. And I didn't know it was a doggo. Needs repaired? Yeah, what we need power this? to this. Ooh. Battery broken. Needs 30 megawatts. All right. Well, we'll come back to this. We'll figure it out. But let's... Ooh, Tim. Here's a nice area. Maybe. It's flat. Yeah, I don't think you can get rid of these crashes, so that kind of sucks that it's right here. It'd be like right in the middle of everything. Right here is kind of flat. Oh, look out here, guys. Ooh, yeah, guy. where Nate's at. There's a bad guy over there. Cover this up. Go up a ways. Put a box over top of it. Grab yeah, I like this. This Well, yeah. We could like I mean, start it at a higher dangerous. level. Start yeah. it right on top of this cliff. I mean, we like can always cover level. it up entirely. Ooh, I got some sulfur. Never mind, that's not a full deposit. Oh, I'm getting fire spit at me. Yeah, there's a bad guy over here. I'm coming, I'm coming. Uh -huh. Oh, shoot, I'm about to die. I'm dead. This eat your food, dead. eat your food. All right, I got the meat. All right. Or I'm not oh, dead. He's being attacked. Oh, We're coming, dead. Nate. Rhinos. Oh, frame drops. It was my respawn, probably. Reload a whole different You area. got one? You got that. He's dead? They're dead. We avenged you. Thank you. Much appreciated. I think what we need to do yeah. is a conveyor belt. Of, oh, this is not um, a plant. This is an animal. 
Hello. I come in peace. No, that's the thing that uh, farts. Is it? Yeah, that's the thing that farts. Oh. So start farting. All right. We need a plan. So I'm going to propose mm -hmm. a plan. All right. And then we can go like on it. a plan. Okay. We get automatic sandstone all the way over here into a storage unit. Then we just focus on building the whole floor with that limestone. Uh, yeah, it's fine. With me. Is this where we want to build? I like it. I think if we start at this level, then we can get over top of that crash site and over top of everything and have a really big flat area to start building. Yeah, something like this probably work. Just place it. All right, let's go. I'm ready. We can make it bigger later. So maybe start with making a square that we could start like build our hut in at least for now. Maybe like, I don't know, 20 by 20 or something like that. Hold and on, then on, expand on. it outward from there. And then we need to we need to make sure that our ramps that we have ramps going down. Okay, I got ramps. I'll go over and get the uh, steel stuff running. All right, guys. Well, we've gotten ourselves a plan. We're going to build our base kind of over there. Um, because things were getting a little bit wild at uh, where we started there and it was, gets kind of stressful when you're building stuff and don't have a plan and everything just turns into spaghetti conveyor belts all over the place tripping you up doesn't look very good not organized so we're going to build ourselves a big giant flat platform over there that we can build factories and our home base slash hud and uh, stuff like that. So, uh, yeah, making some progress. Um, yeah, hop into the hop into the next episode and uh, see where this thing goes. See you guys.